Welcome to Sphere. I am Price Time, and you're watching Sphere TV. In the crypto and DeFi space, more and more unique blockchains are being introduced as time goes on, pushing forward innovation and accessibility. Sometimes these blockchains can communicate with one another, but oftentimes they do not. This has led to the demand for and creation of ways to link together different blockchains to enhance interoperability. One of the most common methods of enabling cross-chain compatibility are through crypto bridges. Bridges allow users to migrate compatible assets from one blockchain to another. Unfortunately, this adds a layer of security risk that opens the door to hackers. In fact, there has already been an estimated $2.5 billion worth of lost funds between June 2016 and February 2023 as a result of bridge hacks. For financial systems that stand for decentralization, self-custody, immutability, and transparency, this level of security risk is not acceptable and calls for alternative means of reaching towards a future that is seamlessly and securely cross-chain compatible. This is where Layer Zero enters the scene. Layer Zero is an interoperability protocol that enables the seamless realization of cross-chain applications. Unlike bridges, Layer Zero uses a low-level communication primitive to connect blockchains, thereby enhancing security. Without going into too much detail, Layer Zero makes it possible and easy for protocols to build applications and then scale those applications seamlessly to all other blockchains, hence omnichain interoperability. With omnichain compatibility comes omnichain fungible tokens, or OFTs. Such tokens can be minted or created on nearly any conceivable chain thanks to Layer Zero. To best illustrate OFTs, let's use an example. Prion is a CDP with unique tokenomics coming soon to the DeFi space. Prion will allow users to deposit collateral to borrow the Star stablecoin. Prion also has a VE governance token, also called Prion. There are other elements of Prion that make it stand out from other CDPs, such as yield farming, Oprion emissions, and unique integrations with the Sphere ecosystem. But for the purposes of this video, let's simply stay focused on the Star and Prion tokens. Remember, Star will be Prion's stablecoin, and Prion will be the VE governance token. Importantly, both Star and Prion will be omnichain fungible tokens through Layer Zero's technology, meaning that they can be created or minted cross-chain. For example, a user could deposit collateral on Arbitrum and mint star on Polygon, or they could deposit on Polygon and mint on Arbitrum. This will allow users to easily expand their ability to mobilize assets across different blockchains. And as more and more blockchains are created and integrated, so too will star and prion be able to scale effortlessly. With omnichain fungibility, the possibilities become endless. This also eliminates bridging risk, bringing enhanced security for users and simplifying the protocol as OFTs eliminate the need for token wrappers. With so many unique tokenomics and the ability to effortlessly scale into omnichain interoperability through Layer Zero, it is no wonder why we at Sphere are so excited for the upcoming release of Prion. Visit us on Discord to stay up to date on announcements and join our community. This video and channel is for educational purposes only and is not financial advice. Please do your own due diligence in order to make sound financial decisions. Thanks for watching and always remember that you matter for who you are. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Sphere.